this video I'll show you guys what it takes when programming the uh, intimidators this with the LED board here now I've just got this side panel off but you do not need to remove this in order to change the board settings I thought I'd give you guys a little glimpse at the inside of the gun and how kind of how it's all set up inside okay so what you want to do you just turn your gun on see Bob Long 1.7 software and it'll tell you battery life and everything now once it's in this which is your normal firing mode and everything what you want to do is you want to take your fingers and hold down the 1 and 2 back here now when you do it'll change to the programming mode right now I've got uh, next selection is uh, key 1 and key 2 is enter the current one selected right now I've got dwell selected and I'm don't, not really going to mess with that um, if you wanted to all you got to do is hit 2 and it'll go into it then 1 to change it hit 2 it'll take you back in your normal firing mode then all you got to do is re-enter programming mode now I mode's next this gun doesn't just you can't just hit the power button or one of these secondary buttons to switch the eyes off you have to be in an actual programming mode which is a little different than how normal guns are set up but um, I haven't really encountered problems with it you either have delay I like an eye delay mode uh, four shot which is what you normally have a gun set like and then there's a dry firing which is the eyes off next is the ball in place and then followed by the cap BPS and the cap can be set anywhere from 5 to 18 BPS I just have it on 13 um, next is the PSP um, cap uh, or a uh, just normal all around cap hit 2 I'll show you there right now it's on non PSP mode non capped um, now if I set it like this it's set to PSP regulations with the cap BPS on now non PSP regulations with the cap on PSP regulations with no cap on and next is back to the non PSP non cap and I'll enter programming mode for you okay I'll cycle back through next is debounce uh, mechanical bounce and comp mode that's your firing mode I'll show you here All right now I have my gun set up on semi-auto next setting would be full auto which is like NXL full auto next one's three shot which would be basically be PS3 PSP three shot next is two shot which is the millennium and next is three ramp which I'm not sure the difference between three ramp and two ramp and then there's smart ramp which only shoots as fast as you're pulling the trigger so if you're just barely tapping it and just one balling it it's not going to kick in and reach the max BPS unless you're getting on the trigger again so I'll put it back on semi-auto hit 2 to save and re-entering programming mode and show I believe the last setting is the ramping BPS whenever ramping will kick in um, and yet right now I have it set on 8 BPS and then once you've gone through all the settings and you hit 1 it'll cycle back to the normal thing and you can keep playing you can do this on the field you can do it off the field you can do it whenever you can set a tournament lock up which um, I'm not quite sure how to do yet I'm just getting introduced with this board but there y'all go and just hold the power button down until the screen shuts off 